Hello guys and welcome back to another brand new app and mobile game. Now this alongside alongside Gears Pop is definitely one of my new favourite games. And on I think the 5th of September the Fist of the North Star mobile game will be out. Which also will be one of my favourites. Now this is One Punch Man. Uh, my brother, I haven't watched the anime yet. I have started watching it. I have to say it is incredible, but I've I've been playing this for a few days now, and I think it's really good. And as I always like to do, I've been saving all my recruitments. So I'm going to come in and do that now. I'm going to recruit times ten. Let's see what we get. Um, the the odds on this game. So I'm going to do one first to show you. So if it's purple, that's a character. So it's green, which which is just shards in the rare one. So I have to say that the the actual drop rates in this game are some of the worst drop rates I've ever seen in my life. But let, let's just let's just jump in. Let's do it ten times. I've never done a ten times in this game. So Okay, we got three purples, which is pretty mental. So who do we get here? That's good because I already had him, which means I can level him up and he's one of my main characters, so that's good. 40 I got this guy. Let's see what his skill is. Let's see what he does. Is he a single attack? Uh, that's pretty lame. I like the multiple attacks. Who's this we got? If I got... Oh, I got him. I've, I think I already had him, yeah. So that's quite good because that gave me 40 more of his shards. So, to be honest with you, that was a pretty decent first summoning, guys. If I turn the volume off, I have. Right, let's turn the volume on for this game. So, yeah, that was a pretty decent summoning, guys. Um, I wonder if that's completed any missions for me. Oh, it's, it's done a recruitment mission. Oh, I would have thought there would have been some achievements or something for that. Oh, that's lame. So, I I don't really bother with the uh, with the sort of strong to road thing. But I do make sure I do these every day. So I'll show you my characters, guys. So this is my favourite character because he's just got so much health. Like, it is phenomenal the amount of health this guy has. Um, I can't do that yet because I can't unlock those yet. But I, what that has probably allowed me to do is I can upgrade this move again. So, and this is his special move. So that's going to burn it into... Uh, is, is that good? It might, it might be something better. No, I am going to upgrade that again, like that. So I'm going to upgrade that again. Boom. And then what I want to do is see if I can upgrade that max. Which I can do. So I've got that to the max level. That's level 3. Like that. So that's maxed out now. Level 4. So what I might do is um, save up to do that one next. But like I said, that that's quite good the way that works. Um, I was looking at so at the beginning of combat generator shield. So I was thinking about upgrading that one. Because I think that's quite useful as well. But what I'm doing at the moment is trying to upgrade um, this guy to the next level. So these are sort of my main characters here. So to be honest with you, that summoning was pretty useful. Um, let's continue the grind to see if I can get some more of these. So I need some more of those. So let's go on to random stage. Don't want any of those. Green, straight off the bat. Two of them. Let's go and get them. Let's go and get them. So you, you kind of navigate around this little map, which I think is quite cool. It's a bit of a change, this game. It's, it's a bit fresher. I, I think it's a lot better. So for the for when we're playing, I am gonna, I'm not going to put on auto when we play. Um, but what I normally like to do is just save up five for um, him and just activate his special. And you'll see, now obviously I've upgraded it as well. You'll see how ridiculous this is. So I've upgraded it max. And it's that burning damage there. And it just rinses them down. And obviously, because that's good, because it attacks everyone. That's why I like it so much. Ooh, that's nice. So I'm going to do the same... I'll put on auto just so you guys can see one, because then, then they do all the sort of combo. You can do it obviously all the manual, but if you do on auto, it does all the cool combo chaining that you can do. What 
have to say, I proper rate the guy on the front. He's proper useful, that tank. So here. So, okay, he has just used that. Normally, they don't go for that one. Yeah, and then they can chain up for that. Oh, they bur burnt him out. Like that. Burnt them out. Nice and easy. So, I'm just not strong enough to do the next sort of set of missions. But I'm kind of okay in... Um, doing these ones because the next story mission is quite difficult so i'm a little bit stuck on it unfortunately but like i said I, i'm doing quite well on just sort of spiring through these ones every day and kind of giving me that, that that main little bit i need so that's good that rapid move there's a very rare chance he can activate that when he's playing and when he does it honestly drops in the damage it drops in the damage big time Bang. That was a nice hit. So I'm going to... Oh, golden chest up there as well. Oh, there's loads of... Okay, I, I must have got quite a lucky one because there's a golden chest down there as well. So let's open that up. Confirm. As I can get that golden chest. It was going to give me anything good. Not really. You can build the maps to get certain stuff, but it's never that decent. Let's, let's look let's see what's in this chest. 300 what? That's mental. 300 diamonds in there. Alright, that's pure luck. That is pure luck, that was. That means I can do another summoning. So I'm hoping that I can get more of his um, shards. Just so I can keep the levels flying up. That would be like one of the most ideal things I could possibly do. If I could get more of his shards. Which would probably be quite rare to happen. I don't really see that happening. But if we're lucky. If we're lucky we're going to be able to summon some more shards up here. I really, so I'm, I'm kind of. I was debating on maximum battle. But then I kind of wanted to try and get everybody up to level 3 that I use. Because um, I thought that's kind of one of the most important things to do. And it's very useful to kind of level up your whole team regardless than one character. So go up there. So I'm going to take off of auto just so. I would love to get some more shards for the tank top guy. Because his shield is so vital. I might see if I can use some of those. Because um, you can get like uh, invis invis shards. Which you can use on any character. So I might use that on his shield. I know, I know that's not the most exciting thing to upgrade. But look. He just sits there and inhales damage. So watch this. He'll take all of this. Watch. Nothing. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to see if I've got enough shards to upgrade it. So I'm going to use a tackle so I know that'll kill someone straight away. Level 21. Yes, let's go, guys. That hopefully would have given me some more stamina as well. Sometimes you do rarely get given more. Very, very rarely, though, I have to add. So let's see if I can... Um, oh, I can do another recruitment. So let's recruit another 10. So let's go. Let's go. Come on. Give me some purples. Give me some purples. I got a blue. I don't know what blue is. Ah, oh, yeah, I definitely used all my luck. Oh, no, I got eight more of him. Five of him, which I have. That was horrendous. That was absolutely horrendous. Okay, cool. Let me go into it. Because you can roll the dice. This, this game mode is so rubbish. But you do... You want to do one a day... And you can quit out. That's just literally so you do the daily mission. Right, so I always like to see what's in the supermarket. I feel 
think I'm pretty sure someone needs some of that. Did someone need that or am I going mental? You get a bonus for buying a supermarket as well. If I go into the characters. I think she... Yeah, she did need that. Cool. She's got to be four stars for that. What does he need to upgrade? He needs like those. I haven't unlocked... I haven't unlocked the guild, the guild yet. Oh, yeah, I was going to see if I could um, use the thing to upgrade his moves. Um, this one. Oh, I don't have enough, unfortunately. Okay, cool. So, I, I did all my... You, you can dispatch people on this game whilst playing it. So, it's always worth doing. And it's kind of always worth... Having quite a nice team as well. So I like to do these ones. Because these can give you some prime summons. So that's out. Um, let's go on to limited. There. So that's those are... Those are really good summoning. So that will give you one premium summon. And this one will also give you one... One premium summon from there. Um, no, I, I don't really care about money. Okay, so a new special mission's appeared. I'll do that before I round the video up, guys. But let, let's... um, I think I can dispatch a few more people. Yeah, might as well. Let's just do that. And then let's just see... There's an hour one here. I can't send it on that. I can't send it on that. Cool. So let's just leave that going. So that's given me... Uh, that has given me... A rare stage that begin. To be honest with you, I don't even know if I'll do that. Because that's pretty dead. Yeah, I'm going to keep going on these. Because this will allow me to 5 star. Because those I only tend to do those rewards if, if they're going to give me diamonds. Or then I just kind of feel it's a little bit pointless. So I want to save up enough of the sort of like invisi shards, you could say, to be able to upgrade his buff of his shield. And that's the next thing I'm going to upgrade max, is, is his, his shield, as, as far as I possibly can upgrade it. So he's going to use a fire move, just watch the damage. Easy kill. Another easy kill. So just like that, it's another easy one. Right, before I do a couple more um, things and round it up, guys, um, I'm just going to show you my sort of my team and what I recommend. Obviously, guys, every single day, make sure you do all of these. Just there's no question about it. You should be wanting to do these every single day without fail. Okay, so if I go into my characters, the next cat I'm going to get to four stars is this guy. I'm getting quite close. I'm going to combine that. And I need four of those and I'll be able to do it. Which I should be able to get relatively easily. And then I'm going to get her up to four stars. I'm noticing I haven't actually maxed her out yet. But that's fine. So I want to use all the XP potions on this guy when I level him. So that's pretty good. And I've kind of just gone through these accessories. Ooh, I can put that on him. Oh, see, I can't even equip that onto this guy. So you kind of just want to put on the highest color, guys. So there's a blue, like that. You want to put on that on all of your characters. You want to put the highest colors on. So she's already got all blues. That's fine. So this is just kind of slightly upgrading my main team as I go along. 
Nothing like hugely noticeable, but it's worth doing. Anyway guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, guys, smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, and I'll see you all in the next one.